Cybercrime has reached catastrophic heights. The content that we deliver is a big differentiator. Our mission is to truly help our customers fight those cyber threats or cyber crime, especially for the SIM market. So stay tuned. News 18 presents Driving the Innovation in Cybersecurity, powered by Securonix. Cybersecurity has definitely taken center stage as India is progressing towards the decade, an era of semiconductors, 5G and digital innovation. Whether it is business or the government, cybersecurity holds a major chunk of investments. The year 2022 was particularly unfortunate for India as we saw a number of cyber attacks on critical infrastructure leading to serious disruption and losses. Enterprises are demanding innovative solutions that can help them secure their system and respond to these attacks. Sychronix is addressing that demand by providing threat detection and response solution. Nike Nair is the newly appointed CEO of Sychronix. She is a seasoned executive with over 25 years of deep industry experience in driving transformation, innovation and growth in large enterprise software companies. Nike currently serves on the boards of TD Cinex, a leading distributor and solution aggregator for IT ecosystem, and Corteva AgriScience, a publicly traded agri-science company. A warm welcome to you, ma'am. Thank you, Sneha. Really glad to be here. It's a pleasure to have you here. So let's get started. We have some questions and we want to know a little more about you and your company. All right. So why don't you please uh, shed some light on what is the sim market here and how is the new age technology you know uh, is going to cope up with it yeah so you know when you step back and look at what's really happening in the entire cyber world i call it uh, cyber crime has reached catastrophic heights mm -hmm. uh, it's no longer just a, a cio or a CISO issue across every company this has become a board topic i'm on public boards myself and uh, this has become a board topic where now the CIOCs are required to come and brief the board on what the security posture is for their enterprise. And when you look at SIM as a category, uh, it's a $5 billion market today. It's actually called security information and event management, predicted to be approximately 10 plus billion by uh, 2025. Mm -hmm. Securonics has been leading the market for last uh, 10 to 12 years. We have been a pioneer in this space. In fact, if you look at the Gartner Magic Quadrant, we have been a visionary and a leader the last four years in a row, right? So we're super happy with where we are. Our goal is to double or quadruple our uh, share in the next two to three years. And that's why I'm super excited about uh, the future for Securonix here. All right, so Securonix recently launched a new product in the market, which is also called the Unified Defense Sim, right? So we want to understand as to how is this product going to change the future or how is it going to help the defenders? You know, Sneha, when you look at Sikinonics, has always pioneered in the entire SIM space, right? We were the very first ones to release the, the cloud version of SIM. We call it Cloud Native SIM. Uh, and this year, we launched what we call the Unified Defense SIM. It actually has uh, four key components. The very first one is the partnership that we announced with Snowflake, mm -hmm. where uh, as a SIM, we can run on Snowflake's data lake. That's a pretty big, powerful offering. Uh, it enables our customers to go from what used to be just a seven days of hot search to a full 365 days of hot search. It's a big differentiator, no other SIM vendor has that. Uh, you know, but what I'm most excited about is our threat content as a service. Uh, similar to any other OTT platforms that you see out there, whether it's Netflix of the world, Amazon's of the world, it's really not the platform that differentiates them, it's really the content that differentiates. So similarly, Securonix, with our threat content as a service, the content that we deliver is a big differentiator. And we are also opening up this so that not just Securonix, but our customers and partners can also contribute their content. Mm -hmm. uh, so that's the second big one. Proactive defense is another big one where we are enabling customers, peer-to-peer -peer collaborations between customers. And the last one is extending the entire experience, the experience to uh, investigate threats, detect them, and also respond to them. All right, so that's a 360 degree turn altogether. Right, absolutely. All so, right. you know, no other vendor has in the market, which is why we are very, very bullish about what this can do for all of our customers, especially 
as they are fighting cybercrime uh, inside the respective organizations. You recently took over the deans of, you know, Sychronix, right? So, how is your experience going to take the company from this level to where it stands to the next level? Yeah. You know, Sneha, I've come from a background where I've always doubled or tripled the size of the company. Right before this, I was a demandee. We went from less than half a billion to a billion plus mm -hmm. in a span of two years. So similarly, uh, Securonics today is approximately 100 plus million mm -hmm. in total revenue. Uh, my goal is to take it to at least a quarter billion to half a billion over the next uh, two to three years. Uh, having done it a few times, a uh, lot of these things that we are doing here is deja vu for me. But the beauty is, like I said, SIM market is a, a five billion dollar market, predicted to be 10 plus billion. We can absolutely uh, take our fair share in the market, and especially India is a big market for us. We have a lot of customers uh, who are our customers of Securonix today, and our goal is to double or triple our share, especially in the India market. Wow, all the very best for that though. No, we're looking forward to it. We're very bullish Absolutely. about it. Absolutely, <laughs> right. All right, so could you please give us a view of India operation in terms of the market share, the revenue, you know, what is it that we are looking at for this current fiscal year? You know, when you look at uh, overall Securonix, 20% of our revenue of Securonix comes from uh, our customers here in India. Okay. We have approximately 10% of the SIM market, and our goal is to at least uh, double or quadruple that number over the next two to three years. We have all the large uh, organizations, our customers today, big financial institutions like HDFC Banks of the World, we also have large global SIs, Wipros of the world, Hitachis of the world, and our goal is to continue to grow that uh, install base. And also from just our development uh, centers, we have pretty large development centers here in Bangalore and also in Pune. Our goal is to continue growing that. So both from taking share, growing our install base, and also investing in R&D here in India is, is a big focus for us as economics going forward. So, Nike, why don't you tell us as to what is the future plan or the growth plan? You know, what is the vision that you have for Sychronix? You know, as uh, cybersecurity is top of mind for every organization globally, right? It doesn't matter the size of the company or uh, the vertical they are in. Our mission is to truly help our customers fight those cyber threats or cyber crime. And that is our mission. And we will do this uh, as we are growing the company significantly. We'll be growing it both with organic and inorganic uh, acquisitions. Uh, today we are 100 plus million. Our goal is to be a quarter billion or half a billion over the next two to three years. So stay tuned. We'll be announcing uh, organic innovations, inorganic acquisitions, also some partnerships that we'll be uh, bringing to market. And together, fast forward two to three years, you will see Securonix being a, a very, very key vendor in the entire cybersecurity space. So uh, a lot to come. Uh, over the next two to three years, I'm super excited about where we are, but where we are also heading globally and also here in India. Wow, I'm like, that sounds super exciting though. Thank you. Really look forward to it. Thanks. <laughs>